Hi everybody. It is Friday, the 9th of uh, November. It's 24 minutes past two. The world is conspiring against me. I've come straight home, wanted to put some washing on, get changed and sit down. It's getting on half past two and I've only just sat down. The Avon lady came pretty much as soon as I got back. Which was great. She said she was coming about two. It was pretty much two o'clock. Perfect. Um, she was ever so nice. Uh, everything I ordered came. And she says thank you for, for being so understanding that they were, um, like, you know, Avon were, were late delivering. Apparently there's been a, a big mess up uh, and stuff hasn't come. Um, but like I said, it was only due yesterday. So me getting it today is it's fine. Um, I says, of course, that's, that's fine. I understand. Um, it's not a problem. Um, she says some people have, have even rang Avon to check. You know, some people on her round have rang Avon to check that they've actually been delayed. And, um, yeah, they've asked her to not go back and stuff like that. And I think that's a bit much. You don't pay in advance. So it's not like you could think she's, um, you know, gone with your money or anything like that. You don't pay until it's in your hands. So, uh, that's... I don't get what's wrong with people. It's not been delayed for weeks or anything like that. It's a day. Anywho, so I'm happy with what I got. I got a new perfume. It smells good. I don't know if that's what I remember from the book, but it smells nice. So I'm happy. I like that. We've got my shower gels and the boys' shampoo and conditioner and their bath paints. I guess I bet they'll be wanting baths tonight. But they're going to come with me to Aldi after work, after work, after school. Because they want to pick up, well I bet they want me to buy them something, but um, I need to get, we have dried apricots, uh, I'll put in Tobin's fruit pot, and I have um, prunes, I like prunes. Um, God, I'm such an old, <laughs> I'm the oldest 36 year old you know, um, but I like them, I have them in my fruit pot. I have some nuts, prunes, a couple of dried apricots, and plum, and some grapes, and like that, it's good for you. Um, I seem to have found a balance where, it, you know, I can eat fruits like that and they don't upset my stomach. So I'm sticking with it and I'm getting, you know, doing my part to have a very diet. Sorry, I was determined to have a big cup of tea. I'm like, I'm having tea. I did, however, eat a, quite a large bad pastry at work. We had the works branch meeting today. It was good. It's, um, it's good to be kept in the loop with what's happening. It's interesting. Um, and we had some on the spot awards and some, what is this bit of hair sticking up? We had a, a three year service award and a five year service award. Um, and you get like a bottle of Bolly, uh, of Bollinger champagne. And you get a new, you get pen and a, a badge or a pin. Um, but with our company, uh, at each stage, I think it's three, five, ten years, fifteen years, stuff like that, you get a pin and it's got a different stone in it, or a badge, it's got a different stone in it, so, you know, I think the top ones have ruby in them or something like that, so you go from a silver one to a gold to something else, um, and I, I believe you get some gift vouchers as well, so it's all very nice, and um, some of the lads in the warehouse that went and worked at our Manchester branch every weekend to help them get a new system set up, they actually missed the works appreciation do because they went to do this. So they got, you know, a uh, crate of beer each or something like that. And so it's all, you know, they do tend to look after people. Um, yes, so that took up a good chunk of the morning and then I got to eat naughty things afterwards. So that was good. Um, yeah, so it was all right. Done for the week now. Yeah. Busy as well today. Um, I have finished a cowl. This is the Broken Ridge cowl again using the mustard yarn and an eight millimeter hook so it's um apologies for the lighting it's you know like half past two in the afternoon and it's gray and miserable it's been raining quite a bit today um uh, so yeah i did 10 rows tall i think um i quite like it did i show you this yesterday i don't think i did that was the hat i finished from the pattern of rails Hi, well. um but I think it's coming out because it's tiny and the brim's not right. Um, 
So yeah, I've done that cowl. I need to find a hat pattern to go with this. I think I've got one that will work. I think it's based on worsted weight yarn. So this could well be probably not far off what Super Saver is, I suppose. Um, so yes, that's that. Um, I made a list last night of things I've made. So I can sort of see where I need to go next. <laughs> fluff on me now so I've got three cows but obviously now I've got four uh, five hedgehogs four octopi the big ones four foxes two santa gonks seven santa gnomes three ball balls that were left from last year so I should probably do a few more of those uh, I've got a scarf left over from last year maybe it's a cow it's the grey shells scarf yeah grey shells scarf I think I joined and made it into a cow, and then a leftover pair of fingerless mitts from last year. So, oh, I didn't put my elf on there. I've got thirty-one items. Thirty-two, yes. So I need to do some more amigurumis, really, some more Christmas-themed ones. Um, so yes, I may have to whip up some more uh, elf parts. Somebody asked me on one of my videos. I'm so sorry I've not gotten back to you. They asked if I was going to make the snowman out of is it simply crochet. I don't know. I don't think I'll make it to sell because of the copyright issues, I suppose. Um, and I don't know how big he is, to be perfectly honest, how long it, it would take. But I don't know. It might be something that I obviously I'll keep hold of the, the download I've got and it could be something for my niece in future years if she's into the snowman. Um, or, you know, as, as someone's Christmas decoration, they can have uh, a snowman to go with it. We were not massively into the snowman. I don't. I think I probably watched it as a kid, but the kids aren't too fussed. I think they've watched it at the school, um, and the snow dog. I think they've seen that more than uh, the snowman. <clears throat> Voice is going. Um, yes. So it's probably just going to be this part for today, unless I, you know, stumble across some yarn in Aldi. I don't know. They keep doing stuff to our Aldi to supposedly make it better, and uh, to be honest, it's not. <laughs> it sounds awful, doesn't it? Spend all this money and do it up, and it's not. To me, I preferred it the way it was before they extended it, and before they, they've already extended it once, and then they closed it for a week and did a load of work on it that, to be honest, they didn't look like it had been shut for a, you know, for a week. I was like, what did you do in the week? Um, I'm sure they did lots, I'm just being mean. <laughs> but, yeah, I, I don't know. It, it just doesn't seem any, or vastly different, really, for for all the money they pumped into it. I'm like, one of those, if it ain't broke, don't fix it jobbies. But Anyway, I'm going to stop moaning and waffling. I'm going to do some, actually, I need to do some comping rather than some crochet. I will win something soon, I'm sure. Please. <laughs> win everybody's Christmas presents, that would be really good. Quite handy. So I'm going to leave it here. Um, take it this is the end of the video. Um, unless I magically find something that I feel the need to show you today. But if I do answer for buying anything, I'll probably show you it tomorrow. So I hope you've had a good Friday. I hope you've got something nice planned for the weekend. And I will see you later. Bye.